Uh, yo, what is going on guys? Mr. NASCAR back at it again with another video. So, today we're going to be reviewing um, Tony Stewart's number 29 Kid Rock um, Bush Series um, Chevrolet Monte Carlo. This car is a very <laughs> nice paint scheme. Um, the reason that it's my second least favorite is because, well, I'm not. you can't really see this on camera, but it's kind of uneven. It's like really uneven. The wheels are just off. But I, I love the car. It's a nice paint scheme. It's like, you know, patriotic and stuff. So let's take a look at the front of the car here. We have, you know, Monte Carlo. We've got the headlights and everything, the grill. We do have an opening hood. Let's just go ahead and open up this hood because, you know, it opens up. There's the nice engine in there. And they're very detailed engine. Um, over to the side now, you got, you know, Kid Rock and some dude there. You got Action. 29, you got the paint stripes, the stars, good the tires, good year. Got Bush Series and Mechanics Wear and NASCAR race car. Um, over to the back of the car, you got just straight up rock or kid, kid rock. rock. The uh, tail lights 29 and the Chevrolet, Chevrolet logo. Other side, only thing that's different is there are the tailpipes. And then to the roof of the car, you have Kid Rock um, 29, the windshield and everything. And then you got whatever the heck that logo is, it's just a bird. A American bird. badass. That's what it says. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this is an American badass. So that's kind of interesting. Um, to the bottom of the car now. That was a really weird noise, by the way, Connor. Um, you know, you got the nice chrome things, and this car also has the key. A key. Um, for I'm, a gas tank. Yeah, I don't, I'm not really gonna do this because I did. I showed you guys what the key does in the last video because there was a key in that car too. It just, all it does, it just opens that. And you shouldn't have forgotten. Right. If you forgot, then you just need to go to a mental hospital and work on your memory. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, of course, you know, you got your sticker tires because you can't go out there with scuffs because that's just dumb. <laughs> why? Um, you know, nice, very detailed bottom. Um, I, I felt, why is it so short than the other one? I don't know why it's so short. Because you're being, uh, you need I, to go to I, the mental I, hospital. Man, shut up! So, you know, we have, you know, I like the paint scheme. It's a very nice paint scheme, honestly. Got the blue up here and the blue numbers. And then the red stripes on it. I'm with a dude. With an ugly dude. Just like the Oh, wait. Car. So, this is, I, I know this is, that's his tattoo. That says American Badass. <laughs> <laughs> it's so weird. Uh, the wheels do turn on this car. They, they do turn. That's a very beautiful. And they also um, have sticker tires. And the interior, it's not very colored. I already said sticker tires. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. You have the you leather windshield. Video. You got the, you know, window. The, Why, the what the frick windshield. did the camera just do? Okay, interesting. <laughs> I, I meant leather window now. Sorry, guys. Yeah. It's a uh, yeah and the window I told bars. You, you need to go to the mental hospital. I'm sorry, man. You got sponsors. Uh, Sunoco. That's interesting. And yo, why is that 29 on the headlight? I guess that's just how they it did it back in the day. It was in the last car, too. Man, shut up! Um, is, is there, either way, this is a very nice car. I love the paint scheme. I just wish that the car was actually flat on the ground and not freaking diagonal upwards because then it just creates lift and it diagonal becomes an airplane. Upwards. Yeah, look, it goes diagonally upwards. Okay. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you want to, you can turn on notifications. Just, I, I, I upload daily content, or at least I try to. Um, but thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next DieCast review.